moved from having a dinner where I would only look at money and eat it to a dinner where we can look at projects that are going to make sense to us. And I would like to tell you that last year when we had the and when we had the fourth Anz and Anis dinner at the board, we thought that idea would not come back this year because of the fate. So it gives me joy a few years down the road to see that Wevaja is growing from strength to significance. Clap for them. <laughs> Rotary in Uganda is growing. We are seeing formation of clubs in every corner, having over 60 clubs in Kampala alone, with so many in provisional status. Wevaja is one of my dear clubs. We discussed and convinced him and the club that we put up a geriatric support center where people, except the acute cases, are not going to come to be housed in, but they come there, their problems are attended to, and they are later followed up in their homes. <laughs> gentleman or to a man and Andy is a man or a husband to a wife so we thought that we, sh we should celebrate each other and have fun and enjoy together. My name is Anne Nambatia. I'm the president elect of uh, a Rotary Club of Webacha. Uh, today we have been having a dinner, a fundraiser, a fundraising for the elderly. We want to construct the geriatric center, a home for the elderly. And as Rotarians, we never let down the communities. And one of the projects which is being undertaken this year by this club is to build homes. So through Anz and Andy's dinner, we have been able to collect uh, uh, some funds towards the cause. We have to find more partners, we have to buy land, we have to construct. It is not a one-year project, it is an ongoing project. The first of its kind because there is no Rotary Club that has ever had such an event. assistant governor and um, they have a special part in my heart. The project they have decided to choose is just an amazing one towards the geriatric center and um, I told them I will be with them through the end even after my term of office. As Rotarians we are people who are good-hearted. We are not so rich but however we are not poor but we always find to to, to provide the less privileged and then improve their lives. Uh, this is something which for us as Rotarians we believe we can do something to do a lot of sensitization, to tell the non-Rotarians that whichever little you give can save a life and can make a difference in someone's life. <laughs> been a very very successful event it has happened at plot 82 uh, next side drive in Luzida where PDG Ken resides we have had so many Rotarians we've had so many clubs we've had so many people supporting us and pledging money 
We've raised over 80 million in pledges, and for this dinner, I think we are going to have the geriatric support center done in Uganda. Um, the last message towards the viewers, I'm so grateful and humbled for all the, the, the guests and uh, everybody who has contributed towards the, the, the cause. And I would also love to thank our sponsors. Thank you so much. Even next year we shall have uh, the same cause. I, I think um, this has been an amazing event and um, the cause is very worthy as we look at the geriatrics, the elderly people. They are coming more into being and we are becoming more busy in our lives so we th really need to put more emphasis in how the elderly live their last. <laughs> Baby, I'm here to